Hey YouTube, it's, it's Princess Jane. I'm back with another YouTube video, and today I'm gonna be doing another get ready with me for work. But I'm gonna be um t like you know giving y'all some tips on getting a job and working and stuff because I just feel like it's a good video. Cause when I was um when I was looking for a job, I was trying to find YouTube videos, but I couldn't like yeah. But anyways, y'all, let me show y'all my room because I redid it a little bit. And I feel like it looks a little bit more better. So I'm gonna show y'all how to. I saw, of course, feel like it looked better in person, but like everything over here is still the same. Um, you know, um, this is like way more light purple, so I don't know why. So okay, that's what it looks like, kinda. Anyway, yeah. So then I moved my bed back to where like it originally was. I feel like it looks much more better like this. And then my desk is like slanted. I don't know. It might look small on camera, but it's more spacious. And then, oh, I still got to clean under there. We're not even going to talk about that. And then, yeah, this is like what this little area looks like. So, yeah, um, hopefully the quality looks better because I don't know what was going on. But um, anyway, I'm going to try to find somewhere to set the camera because yeah all right y'all so let me turn all the lights on all right y'all so um I'm, I'm gonna probably have my hair in a bun today because yeah <laughs> but um anyway if y'all don't know already i work at wendy's This phone died, what? It's 11.45. But yeah, so if y'all don't know already, I work at Wendy's and I got hired on the spot. Um, I'm pretty sure it's because they just needed people, so yeah. But anyways, um, I have been working there for probably like, what, a month and a half now? Or something like that. It felt like forever, but it's not. But, um, yeah. So, when I got up there, I was, of course, nervous because I went through so many interviews and I never was getting a job. Like, listen, y'all. I went through so many interviews. So many. Too many. But, yeah, too many, like I said. And yeah, so um, it was one day after school. I had an interview at Wendy's and oh yeah, we was just like, we had just got to school cause we were testing or whatever. So we got out early at 12 and my mom came in to pick us up and we just went to go do a little shopping, like looking around or whatever. And we got some curtains and stuff. Um, Yeah. And it was like the Wendy's right there. It was a Wendy's right there. My mom was like, oh, I think this is the one. So, you know, then we went back home. We ate Burger King, blah, blah, blah. And then. Balance out your juice with the water. But anyway. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So, you know, I went into the in there and I was like nervous because, you know, like I said, I kept getting declined and, you know, I was just praying that I got the job because I really, really wanted a job for many reasons. And yeah. So then, you know, I went to the interview and he didn't even really like ask many questions. I mean, of course, the of course, the things that you're going to need is your social security and like your ID. And I have both of those. So yeah. Um then of course <sighs> Hold on. Well yeah. So then of course, um, you know, he had took it to the back because he said that he needed to print it out or whatever. Like I don't know. But yeah, I was nervous. I I was trying to think of the questions they were gonna ask because when I had interviews at Sonic um and mcdonald's they asked like questions that i like had no clue about I'm like what so i'm over here confused but yeah so 
so I'm nervous and everything. Like, oh, snap. But yeah, but it wasn't even that bad. But not interview, not every interview, you're probably going to get hired on the spot. So you got to keep it from. But anyways, huh, like, what is, where did this come from? I don't know where that material came from. <sighs> My hair is done. I'm just playing. But anyway, y'all, yeah. So like I was saying, um, when like also oh yeah but like i was saying i think i was talking about the customers yeah i never knew that customers would like be so rude to you like when i take orders bm yeah. y'all listen all right bm yeah, y'all so like when i take orders um sometimes it is sometimes it's hard to hear the customers so you know i'll like ask i'll ask them to repeat it and, and then they'll be like oh you can't hear or things like that and like like things like that kind of irritate me because it's like why like why are you being rude to me all i did like you know but but y'all but it's just gonna happen and plus like my boss was telling us like you know well like just be chill because like it's fast food like it's not really that serious to be mad like you know like just keep the customer happy so y'all can keep y'all jobs and keep doing what y'all doing like you know and that that's just the best advice that you could like you know like also like my mama told me like don't let nobody ruin your day and y'all probably like okay but it's hard but like like i said like don't let nobody ruin your day like regardless or if you're having a bad day don't ruin anyone else's day because y'all don't do that that's just no like yeah like that's what i feel like like i just feel like i don't know like working in fast food you're gonna learn to um i feel like you're gonna um learn to really like be patient like you're gonna learn to be patient you're gonna have to learn to be patient and it's gonna be hard i still haven't even fully mastered being patient but but i'm getting there i explain it i mean i do but i don't want to you know say too y'all probably think that it doesn't or people probably gonna be hating like oh i make more but it's like and at least i'm still getting money like saving is not bad for me but sometimes when i spend i spend large amounts so yeah so that's how it ends up going by quick because i spend in large amounts okay big ball i'm just saying but yeah so yeah also y'all save y'all money like it's hard to save money it is but just like just, just set a goal for yourself like like only take money out when it's an emergency and that's something that i have a problem with like say for example like i like just in case i don't have enough money i'll take some out of my savings but just, just try like to take a certain amount of money out every time and leave it there try your best and like me even if i fail i'm gonna still keep doing it every check i'm gonna still keep doing every check and then i might even add more you know but yeah like um yeah also hmm what else oh yeah when trying to get a job you need to apply every single day every day like every day like when i say every day i mean every day because like like you you can't just apply once and expect them to you know uh you can't apply once and then expect them to call you back immediately sometimes it might and sometimes it won't but it's not a guarantee so like i say apply every single day every day and keep trying y'all like do not give up so let me tell y'all me in my journey i was like so close to giving up or no no no. see like the thing about me is i train my i train my mind like no matter what to not give up and i i, I like i really really um hope that y'all train your mind to do the same thing like just train your mind to never give up because like before i used to be weak-minded i guess you could say but now i'm not at all like at all like like times will get hard or i said time <laughs> times get hard too but anyway y'all um like things do get hard but you just can't give up like train yourself that no matter what like like when i was um like when I was going through my interviews, I was kind of getting a little sad because like I was like, 
I was, um, you know, not getting the jobs and I'm like, what am I doing wrong? And you know, I always talked to God about it. I was getting really sad. And then, then I finally got a job like y'all. I would literally pray about it every day. I would write it down in my notebook, not manifesting. I just would write about it because writing about things helps. So yeah, I don't think I'm gonna do my edges today, y'all. It's too hot. I'm not even gonna lie. Ooh, don't play with me in all of this hair, okay, honey? Okay, honey. I try not. I I am finna do my edges. I'm lying to y'all. I'm, I'm lying to y'all. Um, <laughs> cause don't play with me. Like, mom, y'all already know about me and my edges. But anyway, y'all, I'm gonna go do my edges real quick, and I'll be right back. I will bring y'all with me. But like, my stuff is in my mom room. I didn't know that I left it in there. Wait, I'm. I probably didn't. Nah, I did. Like, I thought that I took it with me. I took it with me <clears throat> but yeah and my mom's sleeping there and i don't want to be talking to y'all and then then she wake up and then she slap me so brb all right y'all so as y'all can see i just did my edges hold on yeah the camera is not doing its job okay the camera is not doing its job and this is not still sitting up correctly but anyways y'all I'm gonna tie my hair up and then get dressed for work. Oh yeah, also y'all, let me tell y'all some tips when getting a job. So, when you first get a job, um, well, even when you first are coming into a job, be open about meeting new people. Cause me, I know I don't have friends. I don't have any friends, so I don't really, you know, really click with people that much because. I just don't have a good history with friends, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, like once getting a job, I would just say open yourself up more. Like, like don't go in there being bougie and stingy because, you know, they've been there and whatever. Um, This is my new bonnet per her. But anyway. Yeah, y'all. Also, be on time because if you're on time, then that's going to make... You know, the boss think of you as more reliable because look, y'all, the main, you want more hours. Yeah, like me, I just feel like I'm a good worker. I really do feel like that. Like, just me personally, I feel like I get done what I need to get done and stuff. And everything like that. What is that? Anyway. And then the camera keep on messing up. Mm. honestly those are like all of the tips that i have i probably have more but the main tip is like don't give up like like when i first started working at wendy's i was like finna cry already oh snap yeah when i first started working there like probably my first or second day i was like i think it was the second day yeah or first i don't know because look y'all I didn't know the difference between a small and a value cup because like i don't know or the kid cups which the kid cups are obviously little but i was just i just didn't know it was my it was my first job ever so you know but then like this one dude he was like like you've been doing the same cups for three orders how do you not know what it is so i yelled at him back and when i'm mad and i yell i start crying but not because i'm sad because i'm mad so, you know, I was mad and I'm like, dang, what did I get myself into? Do I really want this job? But, you know, I just kept it because ain't nobody finna mess up my money. Alright, y'all, so tell me why I'm getting, I'm getting dressed for work. And look, it's a fat. The people at work probably won't think I'm dirty. But, no, I just washed all of my clothes last night. And this paint did not come out. Hold on, let me do a 360 for y'all. <laughs> This paint did not come out. Cause look, me and my brother was painting and that, that video is coming out. That video is coming out um after this video. Actually, I don't know which video gonna come out first, but y'all gonna see. So yeah, and 
Yeah, that's what happened. And he had put some on me. No, no, no. He either put some on me or I accidentally, um, because I'm just going to blame him. But yeah, one of those two happened. Yeah, and I'll also bring my Apple Watch. The Apple Watch comes in handy at work because, you know, you can't be on your phone. So, you know, if I need to check a message, I'll just check it real quick. So, yeah. They're probably going to think I'm dirty, y'all. But I'm not. And I wash my butt. But not anyway. Let me. So today I'm wearing this same strawberry shortcake. Because my sister put me on. And it smells good. Why should my edges be white? Oh, okay. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah, I tell you why. When I first worked there, I was the only person with them work shoes, but now, like, 13 million other people got it. But I ain't saying they jocking me because nobody ever, um, even knew for real. These little shoes. Ooh, y'all have mine is B. <laughs> Yeah, I literally love my room. Like, I'm going to buy some more decor because I love my room. Like, y'all, make y'all room into y'all, into y'all safe spot, space. Because I love my room. Like, I love redecorating, everything like that. I do got to wet up some of my edges because, yeah. But hold on. <laughs> 